Morning guys, it's a late intro. Um, so I've already been paddling for about two and a half, three hours. And uh, yeah, I managed to Katonkel so far. It was a, little, a, a great double up, which we'll see uh, later on in the video. Um, basically, <laughs> I was spinning a, a, a jig, uh, a little Nobi Samurai. And, uh, uh, but yeah, and as I was coming up, or reeling it up, I just got clapped by a Katonko. Some time he took my uh, little uh, Katonko candy as well. So ended up being an absolute mess. <laughs> but well worth it. Great experience. And uh, yeah, I managed to land the two fish. And there was even two baby pup seals uh, eyeballing their morning snack. So yeah, they never managed to sink their teeth into it. So it was a flipping excellent start for me. Anyway, so we're doing a couple more rounds here. Uh, we at about 50 to 55 meters depth water, 13.3 to 13.5 degrees. Um, uh, water color is uh, greenish. With uh, I'm very chuffed with the two that I've got so far. James Emil, give me a little thumbs up there. Uh, good morning. Emil's first time out on uh, his 575. Uh, uh, how are you feeling, Emil? <laughs> Wonderful. Let's uh, it'll make it better if you catch your first fish on the kayak too. Okay, fish on the jig, yeah? Big one, big one. Oh, nice. Oh no! Fish on the jigs! Double up here! <laughs> yeah, let's see. Okay. Absolute mess, but let's see what comes out. Let's see what comes out here. Oh no! Okay, let's see if I can just pop that in. <laughs> Yo. Okay, let's hold that one. Yeah, let's see what's on here. Little fish on that one. Okay, let's put this down. Grab this one. Onto that one. Let's reel this in. Okay, hopefully we get to land some of these fish, people. Guys. Ah. So. Ah. Look at that rod. around you like a rag doll. And here comes the seals to come and catch my, my winnings. Ok, 
Okay, let's see if I get one in. One at a time, this one. Alright. Get him in here. For now. Ah, this is <laughs> flies are stuck. Now, get this one freed up. Uh, that little seal's waiting patiently. Patiently for me to really my other fish. fish on you. Yeah? Watch ya. Uh... Oh what? But let's see. Bring him up. Ah oh, seals are here. Guys, jeez, this has been a. We got a little seal. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. This is mine. Okay, guys. Jeez, that was insane. So, no ways. Look at these guys. Looking for a free meal. Surprised they didn't actually take it. You know? And this guy's chomping down so hard. There we go. Beautiful. Look at that guy, double up in the... Yeah, that was a mission, but anyways. <laughs> great fish.
that's, a, that's another successful three anchor paddle. Uh, probably my last one for the Bonnie Bonanza that's on at the moment. I think it ends on the eighth. And um, yeah, managed my two Katonkel. So that's three so far for the season. Uh, that's it's that's my fourth fourth outing as well at three anchor. Uh, so yeah, super happy with that. And then yeah, man, I I would just like to give uh, Coral Wetsuits a huge huge shout out. Uh, they were kind enough to kit us out with um, some nice boots, a uh, little farmer John, um, and also a second skin, which I won't show you now. <laughs> but uh, yeah, Elaine has been great with Coral Wetsuits. Um, they they measure everything so that it fits you uh, snug and uh, as comfortable as it can be. I've used other brands prior uh, which weren't bad but this has just been next level. So yeah, if you're looking to get yourselves a nice Farmer John, which if you do fish in three anchor or any of the Cape Water I'd say, um, or in winter, it is definitely a must. And yeah, please visit uh, Elaine at Coral. She'll definitely give you top class service. Well, Noby, uh, again, doing the business today. Uh, I will post a little uh, picture of it probably at the end of the video on what I use and what I caught those fish on. 